the 2014 and another thesis in three and we're here at the fantastic Sugar Club on Leeson Street for this year's talks. It's three slides, three minutes to talk about your PhD, 20 speakers this year. And this year it's slightly different. We've opened it out to everyone involved in science, technology, engineering and maths. Let's hope the action is as good as last year. Past eight is a small, walnut-sized structure located underneath the bladder near the rectal wall. In fact, you're not even human. Bang! All you can feel down the back of his legs is a sharp searing pain. When you think of leukaemia, and indeed most cancers, you can think of a garden where the flowers are like our healthy cells, but the weeds are like cancer cells. Systems Biology Ireland and Insight and all the other research centres who are involved in this event put a huge emphasis on science communication and they find that having students who've gone through the process that they're really good ambassadors for their science. The presenters are judged on three things, content, clarity and charisma. For days and weeks we pace and fret and Google all the diseases we think we might get. There must be a better solution out there and I think I found it. It's called Point of Care. I think what we've seen this evening is that people really sat down and thought about, well, what's the really important question that I'm answering here? And how can I explain that to people who don't have any scientific jargon or, or terminology? I suppose it's fair to say uh, what really decided us was the people that really grabbed us and interested us. And if I could give you something to take away, that's exactly what went across all that you talked about today. It's about people. It's that everything that we do and everything that you are doing through your PhDs impact and affect people, be it their society, be it their environment, be it their lives. In third place was speaker Aoife Murphy. Well done, Aoife. In second place, Rory Robertson. The audience prize goes to Dara Whelan. Thesis in three winner is Jennifer Gochran. Doing it as a poem, I wasn't sure if this would be that well received, but when it was, I was absolutely chuffed, I have to say. Imagine yourself in the passenger seat of a car, travelling around the roundabout, that's where you are. Now, as you travel around, you feel yourself pushed. Into the door of the car, you feel you've been smushed. But this year, we went bigger and it was into regional finals, so any STEM student in Ireland could take part. Next year, we're going even bigger. Apart from having regionals, we're going to have a virtual entry. So people on YouTube can submit submissions to videos and they can be part of the process. I would say for anyone thinking of going for Thesis in 3, that they definitely should. It pushes you out of your comfort zone, but for the right reasons. And we all need to be able to discuss the work we do and the research we do with the general public because, well, we need them.